And we also have Amy Hart, Amy Hart, what is this girl's name? Um, Laura, sorry, wow. I just keep forgetting her name. Like, I, there's no shade, no tea. Like, I don't hate or anything. I just keep forgetting her name. We have Laura who also attended this event. Hey guys, it's Murad Morali. Hope you guys are doing well today. So, if you guys don't know, Anna had her massive launch night yesterday in relation to her collaboration with Simi Shoes. Anna and both Mandy, they were both in that recent collaboration, and I did a video on it and I thought it was absolutely great. Now, before we get into this video, if I am correctly posting this whilst I'm posting this video, I have put up a sponsored ad post on my Instagram. I don't normally put a lot of sponsored ad posts via my Instagram, but in this one I am. So please head over to my Instagram at Mirage underscore Morali and just be interactive, like or comment. I'd really, really appreciate it. It's a channel for sponsored posts. So that I would be really appreciated for. So please head over there. Thank you so much. Now, subscribe to my channel as well, click that button and go head over to my Instagram and please look into that post. So I thought what I would do, like, you know, a bit of a review of going over the, the Islanders and what they were wearing because obviously you guys love when I do that when it comes to their events. So this will be definitely be done. This will definitely be done, does that make sense? Um, so I'll just go through it in this video and just see what these Islanders are wearing. And hopefully they've come through with, you know, good outfits. First, we have both Anna and Mandy, the stars of the night, of course, the two people why everybody is there. And we have Mandy, and I feel like Mandy is look. she looks really nice in this outfit. I think yellow suits her. She's got really long hair now. She never had long hair. We saw her to be having quite short hair. And I like the earrings, and I like the color of the lipstick, and just the color of the suit, I think, is very powerful. I feel like she could have left the Fendi bag at home. I feel like it doesn't really go well with the outfit, as well as the shoes, I feel like, are cute, and they go well, but I think just the bag is just a bit too much because we are seeing a lot of accessories here. So, you know, I feel like you should just take it down and notch when it comes to those. Anna, on the other hand, I feel like the color itself, the kind of like satin, silk, kind of pink, kind of like, you know, nice dreamy color, it definitely suits her skin tone. However, I feel like the shoulders are very punchy and I feel like it takes away from just the color of the, um, the outfit. Her, the fit definitely is great for her and I feel like her face is beat and I feel like her lips are as well. As well as, I do like the black bag here. The handbag here she's wearing, I prefer over what Mandy's wearing. But I just feel like the dress, is just, the shoulders are just way too punchy. And they just distract you from the entire outfit. And that's all you're focusing on. And I don't think it's a good outfit at all. Unfortunately, that part just takes it away. I have Amber, and again, wearing very similar dresses to what we see here. There's a lack of, there's a lack of versatility in what she wears. However, they, she does look good in these outfits. I feel like red is definitely her color. The bag suits it, playing it safe with the black um, shoes as well, a bit of color blocking. And then we also have, you know, her hair as she usually is and the face looks beat. But I just wish I would prefer to, to see something else. But again, this doesn't look terrible on it. It definitely suits her. And you know, it's a casual dinner kind of date, you know, very private event. So it's not something massive. And I'm sure she's gonna absolutely slay us when it comes to her Miss Pap launch coming in a couple of days. We then have Miss Amy Hart wearing like, you know, kind of like a black leather kind of like dress with a bag. This is a good look. I actually like this. We haven't really seen Amy in anything similar to this aesthetic. We haven't seen her in leather. So I feel like this is a new fresh look for her. The hair looks great. The face is beat and I do like the earrings. This outfit I feel like is a complete yay for me. Just the, I like the knot and how it cinches in the outfit and just that leather kind of aesthetic we have not seen on her. So it's a fresh, fresh look. We also have Yuande and Elma, both wearing green and yellow, yellow, my color bands, both wearing green and white. Now we're gonna get into Elma first. I do like this outfit. I feel like it definitely suits her. She's definitely tan. I assume she's gone somewhere, probably to the tan salon. Um, but I feel like this outfit does look nice. And I do like the cut of it from the top and but I, and the bottom and the kind of shoulder gap. I think it suits her and her hair looks cute. She's playing it safe. The majority of the girls are when it comes to these events, but I feel like she's looking cute here as well. You one day wearing the full on white. Again, I feel like this outfit does look good. I feel like her hair looks great. The necklaces, the three necklaces look really nice as well. But I feel like she is playing it safe when it comes to the shoes and playing it safe to the outfit in general. It's very plain. I'm not really seeing much going on here. But at the same time, she doesn't look bad in the way. It suits her. She looks good. We also have Harley who is wearing these white leather kind of boots and she's wearing this kind of jacket on top with a weather light with a um, white 
top underneath as well. I feel like this outfit is more catered to an outfit if you're going out with your friends, if you're going out to a club, not really like an event, a private dinner, you're gonna celebrate somebody's collaboration. I feel like it should be more of a smart, casual kind of look. And I feel like she's going for a different aesthetic, a different kind of look for a different type of night. She doesn't look terrible though. I feel like the color blocking here is looking good. She's playing it safe with the colors, but I feel like I would have preferred it if the boots were not there because she's not going out to a club. She's going out to a dinner, so I don't even know. It doesn't look that great. We have Joanna here now wearing high red leather boots and wearing this white kind of top with a, you know, cinched in from the middle. I'm not a fan of it. It doesn't look terrible, but I feel like she's dressed as something out like of Batman, something. I feel like she's Harley Quinn, kind of like a vibe I'm getting. I don't know if you guys are getting this as well. Maybe I'm completely off the charts, but I do feel like I would have liked to see something different. It, I feel like it doesn't suit her as much. The boots I love, but this is this top and how it's cinched in. I'm not a hundred percent fan of it. We also have Curtis and Mora who weren't able to attend, but they were at a different event that same night. And I wanted to review it because I feel like Mora looks absolutely gorgeous here. I just feel like this is what you call a suit that is completely cut perfectly. It's very pristine, it's clean. I just feel like the red lipstick, it's a very bold look with glasses. And I like the fact that her hair, her hair is pulled back because we want to put attention to the outfit, not when it comes to the hair. I feel like Curtis looks good as well. I feel like the tie could have been a different color. I feel like we don't need a burgundy red kind of like dark maroon-ish kind of tie, but he does look good as well. And we also have Amy Hart, Amy Hart, what is this girl's name? Um, Laura, sorry, wow. I just keep forgetting her name, like I, there's no shade, no tea, like I don't hate or anything, I just keep forgetting her name. We have Laura who also attended this event. I'm not a fan of this outfit at all, unfortunately. I feel like it's oversized, I feel like it's very, punchy and boxy on the shoulders and I feel like her sleeves just go way too low I just feel like she's forcing the outfit like are you wearing the outfit or is the outfit wearing you I think I feel like the outfit is wearing you here and again the shoes they're not that bad they're okay I do like the necklace um, that she's wearing and the white bag is cute on the side but I just feel like this outfit is just if maybe it's her stance and the way she's posing but I feel like it looks way too posy here let me know what your thoughts are on this video please do go to my Instagram and be interactive with that sponsored content I would really appreciate it. Follow me on my Instagram, Murad underscore Murali, and I'll catch you guys soon for another video.